we're going to traverse over to here and then we're going to head down 49 switchbacks that's the tail end of the switchbacks right there and then we're going to follow this trail out to the end of the esplanade and the big canyon that's way off in the distance that's where the colorado river is and i'm going to perch us up right over here in this area and uh, we're going to be looking back in this fork at 135 mile rapid and uh, you, you get killer sunsets off of that plus it'll be our first glimpse of the river it never looks the same when it look, it's a perfect example look at the right through here that's called the coconino sandstone right there that dark brown area mm -hmm. now you look at the coconino sandstone right here yeah, two completely yeah. different colors yeah, same exact beginning rock. esplanade We are Leroy's traversing down to go look at the pictographs. This is some good video. Like a pro donor. Absolutely. It's Jeremy trying not to be a 127 hour victim. Hike. We lower our backpacks down by a rope. Thank God for these boots here. Whoa! And on film! <laughs> Yeah, you didn't have that on film. Oh, yeah. No, you, are you serious? Oh, yeah. So they oh, have a super America's Funnest Video. They painted these about 900 years ago, and um, they did some bighorn sheep, and uh, there's a person underneath this as well that's kind of faded out with the sun, and um, then there's some other tribal markings that are on the other side over here. On the point of the Esplanade, looking out towards the Colorado River, there's a 135 mile hour, 135 mile rapid, and here's our campsite, and here's where we're gonna be hiking down tomorrow. Here's Leroy, barely alive. <laughs> Leroy's barely alive. How do you feel, Leroy? Good. Ooh. All right. Uh, yep, and I feel good that. too. And signing off, day one. Awesome. We're going to head east and go through Surprise Valley. And that's where, if you see this side canyon right over here, that's where Tapete's Creek is at. So Thunder River is going to pour out of the Muav limestone, and then it's going to become a tributary to Tapete's Creek. And then Tapete's Creek is going to pour into the Colorado River. Tomorrow night, we're going to sleep on the Colorado River on a sandy beach. We'll follow the river. We'll walk 100 right. feet over the river. And uh, then we're going to cruise back up. And we're going to come on the opposite side of Surprise Valley over here and then up and over into Deer Creek. Okay, and then we hike back. Whenever hike. we come out of Deer Creek, we're going to come back through Surprise Valley. You can see the trail right through here. Got it. And then it comes to a junction and you're going to head back up right there and then we'll, we'll end up on the red wall over here. Make sure there's no scorpions in them. Okay. Good night if I'm on the damn shoe. I'm such a retard. Thing right there. Do you have an aspirin for the swelling right here? You get this? <laughs> Find a shoe. You're not messing with me, are you? No. On the break of the red wall to go into Surprise Valley. All right, Surprise Valley. That's where we're headed. Come around this way. That's where we came from. Lots of colors, lots of flowers. So we're about to walk up the Thunder River, right over here, to the right or to the left of us, and we're going to come up on the Muav limestone, and it's going to be a waterfall that uh, pours out of a hole about this big in the side of the limestone. Here we are. There's our first picture. View of Thunder River. And to say the least, it's one of the prettiest sights Yo. I've seen in my entire life. Yo. Leroy trying to get down. Without breaking my my um, feet. Alright. Here we are coming down Thunder River. Whoa! of Thunder River. We're headed down there. We're going to backpack and hang out for lunch down there at Thunder River. 
There's a nice little pool underneath the uh, hundred. We're getting closer, about a quarter mile away. There's Leroy up there. Say cheese! We are here at Thunder River! Filtering some water. There's the sink and the pump. And the last picture for Thunder River after about a three hour nap. There's the top of it. And there it goes. And the Thunder River. Hello, this is Gary having a fantastic time. I miss everybody. A Love mile you. down Thunder River. Now we're at the confluence of the Peach Creek and Thunder River, and this is the Peach Creek, which flows up to the Colorado. There's a baby mountain lion. It's obviously no longer alive. We're just sitting here at the edge of Tapia Creek, eating some peanuts. Leroy is dressed in his warm up pants because it's nice and cool. Here's the creek. This is me, and I'm nice and hot. Creek. We're hiking up and over to the Colorado. Those mountains up there, and they will be there. That's the south rim right in front of us. A little down climb. Hardcore hiking. Go Buccaneers. Right the Colorado River. There's Leroy. And there's Jeremy. There's a vicious shift. It's 1.7 billion years old. As we continue our hike towards the Colorado River. This is a 135 mile rapid. We saw that last night from uh, where we camped at. And we're going to head down the staircase right here, right through this crevice. And we're going to sleep on this sandy beach tonight, right at the confluence of Tapete's Creek and the Colorado River. Here's the Colorado River. Here's Leroy! Leroy! Woo! And there's Gary! And there is the 135 Rapids! And there's the boat! Colorado River. Hiking down it in the morning. There's everybody else up ahead a little bit. Great day. Continuing our hike along the Colorado River. Nice easy trail. Across Deer Creek. Had to hike up about a quarter of a mile to find a crossing. Another picture of Deer Creek turning into Deer Creek Falls as we go down through the slot canyon. Nine hundred year old handprints. Top of Deer Creek Falls, looking down at the Colorado River. This is the best view I've seen. Well, I can say. Looking down the Colorado. Lots and lots of colors in the mountains. Eric, the river counter. That's right. The yeah. He's hiking in, spending 62 days in the canyon. Yep, that's right. 63. 63. Yeah. Oh, no kidding. Yeah. <laughs> He's living off the ground. He's Did you tell him about Osama? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, Osama bin Laden got killed. 
But we were, he was talking to someone else earlier. They had no idea because they've been out here for so long. You know. Right. And look at that. Uh, uh, deer. Yep. That's kind of boat I was on. So you're finally Deer Creek Falls. I was here 20 years ago, and there's a flash flood at Deer Creek Falls, and the water went all the way out to there, which is about 200 feet from the edge. The entire sky was filled with mud that day. A little closer picture of Deer Creek Falls. I started talking to someone. Don't know if you make up, but there's well, a handprint. 900 years ago, that's where the river was at. Yeah. And I was yeah. like, hey, yeah, really? you hear for Jerry, 900 years like, uh, ago, well, the river was but, there. And, you know, it there's went down where they were right by now, the river at there. Which is about feet 25 feet difference. Here we are, hiking up the canyon. That's where we're headed. Through that pass. Slow and steady. Here we are. Beautiful day. Hiking up the canyon. And it is uh, pretty cool. It's kind of like Hell's Canyon in Vermont. Steep Spring. and rocky. But we're up Deer Creek Springs route. It's not a trail, it's a route. And here's where we came from. The Deer Creek Spring, Waterfall and Springs. Go down this way. Little side trail up that way there where we're headed. Six o'clock in the morning. And the sun is about to hit us. We've been in the shade for the past couple hours. As you can see, as I drop that line, we go into the sun. It's a surprise we are here. And here's where we came from. Can't even tell what the trail was. It's a surprise valley. I can back up again. The is a little bit different, but the boulder field's gone now. Here's the hike. The trail looks like that. This is you can see by the hikers. Oh, wait, that's a movie, actually. It's not open, I don't think. It's a movie, yeah. Oh, oh. stop. <laughs> really? Slow but sure. And that's where we came from, as far as you can see into that valley, down to the right. Up the mountain to the Esplanade. Final push, almost there. It's about 20 minutes later. But honestly, we are in the final push. We just gotta go up to there. It just takes a little bit of time. One step at a time. But I can tell you that I have my sh Merrill shoes on. And the Merrill shoes incredible hiking shoes because we've hiked the hardest route in the Grand Canyon. These narrow hiking shoes are I've lost in space. I'm sure from the 60s or 70s. I'm looking. We continue our hike after a four hour rest on the Esplanade. There's mountains up there where we're hiking tomorrow at 7,200 square feet, 7,200 feet. So we're gonna hike tomorrow to the top of the rim. 